So you've been with Princess now 41 years. I bet 40, you've seen some. Over 41. Years. I bet you've seen many, many changes over the years. Yeah. I mean, when I started in Princess, it was two small ship. Uh, Pacific and Island Princess, the original love boat. I mean, the love boat started in 77. I was there in 74. Mm -hmm. And then I grew up, uh, of course, with them. I was, uh, when I moved to Princess Cruise, I was first cook. Then I became sous chef. I became a chef. And uh, of course, it's an honor for me to be the, f the chef in the original royal princess where the godmother, she was one and only, the Princess Diane is always in the bottom of my heart, here in Southampton, by the way. And it was 15 of November of 1984. And then from then, the, the princess emerged with Sinmar, and it's become a, a big company. Today you have 18 ships in the United States and around the world and four ships fixed in uh, Australia. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's 22 ships. When I joined this company, it was uh, to ship 200,000, 200 people was the entire uh, fleet of passengers. 400 people, it was the crew. It was two nationalities, British and Italian. Mm -hmm. Today, Princess Cruise is 36,000 employees from 78 nationality. <laughs> So there's been a few changes then, you would say, oh, over 41 yes. years. Oh, yes. What would you say are the main changes, though, like from, from your time up to 84 and then moving up now? The industry's changed so much. It's become obviously more accessible to, to everybody now. It's not just the, the hierarchy that can cruise. How do you feel that the industry's changed in regard to the culinary delights of the ship? I mean, I need to say the industry, it moves very fast, very fast because you need to catch because otherwise you lose your train, you know, every year. As a matter of fact, Princess, you build almost one ship every year, and every time you have a new ship, you have a new project, a new, uh, something to offer to our customer, you know. Princess is one of the cruise line where you have the high number of people, repeating people, is over six million people is part of the Captain Circle, and these people come back and come back and come back, and he want to find something new. You know, it was an unthinkable example uh, 10 years ago to put the food one on top of the other, like I did this, uh, this way. It was flat, it was the vegetable, the starch, the uh, protein, uh, all flat. All. Now you get the starch, the vegetable, where is the protein, the, the vitamin and the fiber. Then you get the protein on top, where it's dripping down, give it the flavor to the rest. You know, it's innovation every, every single year.